Hi everyone, welcome to Carlos House. Today we're going to be looking at the Castelli Graffiti short sleeve jerseys. Okay, let's get straight into it. The bag's already open because I ordered a lot of stuff and I wasn't sure which bag it was in. These are the Castelli Graffiti short sleeve jerseys limited edition for 2020 um, i'll just open them up and then we'll have a look at them they are the same apart from the print so let's get cracking okay so these are them out of the bag um they're vastly different so i'm going to open them out we'll have a little look front and back and then we'll look at the uh, design and any features that they've got okay so the first version we're going to look at is this black version with uh, little paint splodges and arrows over it. Okay, moving back up. I'm gonna just flip it over and look at the back. So the back has got a nice uh, big Castelli uh, logo there. Coming down. Okay, let's look at the other one. Okay, this is the second one. As you can see, it's a lot more different if that's even English, more different. Um, lots of bright colors, which is cool. Got to be seen out there. Let's look at the back. Okay, the back again, we've got the same uh, logo on the back, just filled up with graffiti and then big Castelli across the pockets. Okay, let's have a look at the features. Okay, so I've chosen the black one because um, I've recently reviewed a base layer with all that colourful graffiti on. So, okay, so the first thing I've noticed is the neck is not offset. Now, um, on some other jerseys I've reviewed, the neck is um, kind of like this. It's offset so that you get a bit of protection from the zip, but this one actually zips up um, square. Um, the zip's actually pretty cool. So we've got Castelli there, and we've got uh, Made in Bosnia. I don't know if it's just these graffiti things that are getting made in Bosnia, but they seem to have moved um, production. Um, let's have a look at that material close up. It's kind of a nice material there from Castelli. Um, I've still got the tag in let's see if there's anything inside nope just gives you some history and the um number and the color there i think the other one is color 217 so as we open it out we see a gripper along the rear uh, base just above um your bun a uh, gripper there we've got a reflective strip along the bottom here not a big one but it is a reflective strip nothing special on the inside apart from we've got some side uh, vents so these run from the base all the way up to the arm to the armpit all the way up to the armpit is this um, kind of a meshy Meshy fabric, see-through. I'm assuming that is to uh, allow you to cool down a little bit. So we'll just look at on the outside. This is a bit thicker. Then we've got this mesh side panel. Now, as we move up to the arms, I've noticed on a lot of the arms um, this season they're very long. Now I've put I've uh, put on another jersey with long arms and they come down to just above my elbows where um, previous Costelli arms haven't been that long. Once again we've got the raw edge, very very delicate and thin but tough, delicate but tough material, stretchy, good seam. Let's just um turn it around there's nothing more on the inside there so on the on the back we have a printed Costelli logo 
It's actually printed this time. On my, one of my previous videos, I said it was printed, but it was actually a transfer. I kind of knew what I meant. Um, so we've got three pockets along the bottom. This reflective top with the gripper underneath, as you can see. Um, I'm just looking for anything special. Nope, standard zip. That size, the usual uh, long Castelli instructions, washing instructions there. Just this arm. These arms are very long. I'm not a fan of very long arms. Um, I do like a shorter arm and I suppose if you wanted you could cut a bit of the arm off but then it'll probably start fraying. I'm not sure. It just looks as though it's been cut. It doesn't look as though it's protected in any other way. So that is the black jersey. We're just going to have a look quickly in case you didn't see the other um, review. We're just going to have a look quickly at the other colour. So let's put that one aside and let's bring in this colour. Now, this is the 217, as I said, the other one is a 218 colour. It's got the same long arms. A little bit disappointed that the graffiti doesn't go down the arm. That would have been, I would have liked that more because you've got this really nice colour uh, back and front and then it just stops at the arm. It's just solid black, kind of is a bit annoying. Um, printed on Castelli logo, but it's the back that I'm the most interested in because I'm liking that really nice Castelli across the pocket. It's the same as across the chest, but it's on the pocket on this one. And once again, we've got the same gripper on the inside with the reflective panel on the bottom. Nice material there. It's a good race fit. Really uh, looks as though that's going to be brilliant. Um, nice neck. Again, it's got the zip that sits flat and not the staggered zip, as I mentioned before. Inside, we've got a nice zip uh, protector for your uh, neck, front of your neck there, just so the zip doesn't um, annoy you. Overall, some nice jerseys. Right, let's get them weighed, and um, then we'll have a final overall, and that'd be it. Okay, so let's bring it in. It's actually milliliters for some reason. I didn't put it into milliliters, let's just Get it to grams. Okay, so we've folded up the jersey here. Um, this is with the tag as well. Okay, so I need to send it back. 139 grams for the colorful one and he says hoping they're the same. 140 for the black one. So yeah, they're the same. Okay, so that's a little show around the Castelli Graffiti jerseys. We've got the colourful one at the top and then the much more reserved uh, jersey at the bottom. I actually prefer the top one. I think I'm going to stick with that one. Uh, leave your comments in the box below. Tell us which one you think is uh, your favourite. And... Thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, thanks for liking, and we'll see you on the next Chorus House. Take care, bye!